the first thing I'd like you to try is play. So once you press that, this is what appears. It's really simple. Let me give you an easy example. Let's have a go at, say, this one. Okay, so this is the second one here. Okay, I hope you can see that. So, just like I've got up on my board, right? This is a balanced system. You've got two things there, and well, one is exactly equal to the other. So if that green heart is seven, what must the purple diamond be? Must also be seven. Well, oops, I'm gonna put five. Wait, what happened? It went down to the heart. Why, why is my green heart lower? Because it's, yeah, Rinesh? It's heavier, right? So I need to try again. If I put eight, uh-oh, wrong way again. So now if I put in seven and you submit, and then it gives you some stars. Hooray, okay? So now you come back, and I'm going to show you a tricky one. Let's try this one. Oh, hold on a second. Okay, now some of you might be thinking, oh, I think it's four. How can we logic that out? Well, watch this. Watch, 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 watch. If I put my finger on the top thing, it's a mobile, right? Like a spinning mobile, right? If I put it and drag it out, watch what happens. Bam. Now, what is that? We have a word for this. It starts with A, when you don't know what numbers are. What is it? This is algebra, right? Look, look, look. These are just labels. We use letters because these I don't carry color pencils with me, okay, and I can't draw hearts nicely. But that's algebra, yeah? They're labels for numbers. Watch this. Remember they're balanced, both sides? Look, I've got an extra heart there on the left-hand side, see there, that I don't really want. So I'm going to pick that up and pull one out of both sides. Did you see that? Look, I took one out from both sides because I've got to keep things balanced. So if a heart is worth two, and I've got two of them there on the right-hand side, right? So that's how you can know that this um, trapezium thing is... Done. Okay? Now, one more thing I need to show you, and then you can just go for it, okay? Have a look at this one. See that number at the top? That number at the top means that's how heavy the whole thing is. Sometimes you'll see that number, and you need to know. What do you reckon for the blue moon? Does it make sense? Does it all add up to eight? Yes. You bet it does. There he stars, okay? So, I want you to go back to that puzzle menu. If you feel like, oh, these Explorer ones, too easy. Try a puzzler or a master one. And there's lots of pages you can flick through. Go for it.